goss, the dirt, the trash. It's all in Amy's update. Amy and Sean, 1027 VGS. So after Justin Timberlake's uh, DUI, DWI arrest, uh, his mugshot came out, and I said it looks like an album cover. I mean, if his eyes weren't so glossy, it could be a legitimate album cover. You couldn't just tell AI make my uh, make my eyes sober. Probably because AI did make him uh, in his mugshot drink a beer that looks. Too, I mean, too, too real. Creepy. Yes. Yeah. Too real. But uh, somebody actually uh, painted a portrait of the um, of the the mugshot, and it is now at a gallery in Sag Harbor, and the limited edition. <laughs> That's where the DUI took place. Yeah. <laughs> are selling for five hundred and twenty dollars <laughs> a piece. <laughs> What are you going to do with that? Uh, what are you going to do with that? I don't know. Put it towards uh, more breathalyzer tests. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Hopefully they're putting it towards something. I just think it's a little much. I mean. I will say this. Justin Timberlake just had a couple concerts on the East Coast, and he uh, made almost light of his DUI situation. After the first one. The first one he said, like, you know, thank you for loving me, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, then but he was getting light. relaxed. Yeah, like, and I would say that's not the move. Like, you still had a DUI, which is kind of a trash house move. Yeah. Uh, and you weren't, like, slightly drunk, it seems like. So, I don't know. I, I, yeah. He should stop doing that. It's very, <laughs> very interesting, for sure. Hey, uh, this is um, pretty cool for the Hawk Tua girl. <laughs> I she- saw that interview. With she was with Barstool. Oh, she didn't. Yes, yeah. but I, I'm. Th- I mean, that's all. cool. That's cool. But I'm talking about when she was on stage with Zach Bryan. Zach Bryan what? is. <laughs> yeah, Zach Bryan is probably the biggest country star right now, and uh, everybody loves him. He, he was very um, like non radio for a long time, so he's got a lot of like huge, huge fans. He sold out T-Mobile a few weeks ago, and she joined him on stage. She had already had <laughs> tickets to his show. Months in advance, then she goes viral, and then had her team. She has a team, she has a team now. Yeah. Uh, reach out to his team, and they got her on stage. And to be honest, like Zach Bryan was saying, that the security that she needed was insane because everybody wanted to get a picture. People's jaws everybody were dropping, wanted her. She's to Britney do- Spears. All of these things, and uh, pretty, pretty inst- interesting how massive she's she is. She's a big Zach Bryan fan, so I'm sure this is probably one of the coolest things Fuck. that has ever happened to her. <laughs> Honest, so crazy. And uh, lastly, Asia Wilson was interviewed um, on ESPN. I just think it's the coolest thing. There was like three or two WNBA games on last night, and you know the the Aces are on ESPN, and then all of the the post game interviews and things like that that are on ES. It's just so cool to see. And very Vegas question for Asia Wilson. Who is the um, the artist you'd love to see have a residency in Vegas? And she didn't even miss a beat. She didn't even change her face. She said, Beyonce. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, yes, me too, same. And then she's like, but honestly, I know she's really busy. So even if they, if she did a show here that I got to see and then she came to a game, that'd be pretty damn cool. So I'm like, maybe, maybe I'm tell- if she I, goes I to an Aces game. Yeah, you know, I mean. Touring in place is fun. Mm-hmm. <laughs> touring in place is fun, Laura. Like, yeah, you wherever you live, you fly into Vegas. Yeah. Because they don't live here typically. Mm-hmm. Celine did, but a lot don't. Right. They fly in. You do a couple shows. I'm telling you, Sphere, listen to me. Yeah. You get you get yourself like. Well, I mean, look at the Eagles tickets. Are I think they started at 450. Started yeah. started at 450. You need an old white man weekend. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. So you have your Eagles type band in that weekend, and yeah. you have every weekend, every first weekend of the year will be for old white men. <laughs> yeah. And then you got a Beyonce weekend. Yeah. And then you got a I don't know N Sync. Right. I mean, right. they could do. Yeah, I think it could more be, with that problem. It could be pretty cool. So my hope for Asia Wilson and the Aces is that Beyonce pops by a game. Yeah. Pops by a game.